<laughs> yeah, February 2, 2010. Do I have to say, see, I told you so? Here we go with the other um, cycle. Here we go with the cycle of this administration's strategy. Okay, they tried to shove the TARP money down all these big banks, throats, banks that were too big to fail. And then banks said, oh, no, thank you. No, 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 no. We liked the way Paulson was going to do the TARP, where, you know, he was going to invest in our stocks if he thought we were worthy, and that would cause, like, real money from the outside from, from uh, that was earned by real investors who are looking for a an investment and some stock to buy. Um, to invest in us, uh, our banks, and hence, you know, the TARP money would mix with the real money, and um, the stock price might pop, and um, thusly, uh, more money would be created in a natural fashion, instead of, you know, you just uh, firing out all these bucks in every direction, all these Geithner bucks in every single direction around you, um, just covering the area with green like it was snow and um, everybody knowing that uh, you know they don't want to eat that yellow snow you know what I'm saying uh, it's slushy it's really now and now and now you're going to turn it into your slush fund uh, after you uh, try to shove it down the little banks throats the banks that are not too big to fail and they will undoubtedly also push it back, say, oh, no, thank you, I don't do drugs. Uh, get away from me, you pusher. God damn you, pusher man, Obama. And then you won't let them uh, give it back right away. Then they will have to go through a stress test. And they're a lot smaller. And they're not too big to fail. And even if they were, everybody's real sick of hearing that. And seeing that the populist um, read ignorant masses of ignorant voters that's who the populists are okay that's really like mob rules majority even past that majority rules democracy and, well no actually it's just another name for it but anyway nobody wants to hear the too big to fail nobody wants another bailout so all these banks are gonna fall and all you populist fools who might have your money in the bank uh, w will end up um, handing that money eventually over to the government bank because the banks will fail, and the banks is the people's money, dude. If if the if a, a civilian non-governmental type of commercial bank does not hold the people's money, guess who's holding the people's money? Now, yes. They're going to tell you that the people are holding the people's money in the people's bank, right? That is run by the government, the central bank, but really they're holding on to it, huh? If they think you, you didn't pay enough taxes in last year, oh man, well they're holding on to your money anyway. And they can just take as much as they want whenever they want. And they will. Because a dog licks his own balls. Because it can. You know, Clinton did what he did. It's like that book that was wrote about him. And the title was called Because He Can, or Because He Could. That was the title. Because He Could. And, uh, well, you know, Clinton's a man, and a man cannot lick his own balls. But, well, you know how that story ends, don't you? Later on.